Hello Kiss fans, welcome to It's All For You Demon celebrating the fun of being a Kiss fan. And tonight, strange episode tonight, we are doing things tonight we'd normally never ever do on this channel. I got two wieners here. Never done before, may do again. Hopefully we'll do again soon, but this is a never before done experiment. Little Pee Wee, in true Wax Knight fashion, we're doing it old school and we're gonna have a lot of fun with it. Pee Wee, what the heck are you doing? First up, we're going to wax unmasked. It is springtime and the second issue of the Kiss Wax Pack has already gone out and people are receiving it. It is all about unmasked and the spring fun of waxing this record. So we're gonna have a real quick wax and then on to the creme de la creme of the episode. We are going to give away a solo album army kit. Not a full army kit, solo album army kit folder with plenty of goodies inside. It's spring, it's unmasked, it's a giveaway. Let's wax. So as we kick things off tonight, I welcome you to spring and the second issue of the Kiss Wax Pack. Volume 1, number 2, the spring edition has hit mailboxes. It went out last Monday, but tonight we wax spring and here in the Wax Night basement, that means the unmasked record. And I won't give away too much of the Wax Pack in case you haven't joined and you want to, details below. Unmasked. This goes back to college days, why my friends and I, Danny Brett, myself, always waxed this record at springtime, and it all went back to us getting the bootleg of The Inner Sanctum from Peter Arquette on VHS. It was this very VHS tape containing Live in Japan, Young Music Show, and The Inner Sanctum that completely changed everything for us as far as the 1980 Unmasked album. Up until that point, I don't know if any of us really owned Unmasked at the time. I know we had been diving into the back catalog and trying to collect that back catalog on CD. I don't know if we had Unmasked yet. And it was a combination of discovering the Inner Sanctum, Australia Kiss Mania, Australia Kiss Merch, the Unmasked album, that version of Detroit Rock City, Shandy combined with Spring just made this album, made 1980 Kiss for us a total Spring experience. And back then we were really big into those flavor ice pops that you get at the grocery store and we would buy those all the time and watch Inner Sanctum while eating those. I always thought because we associated flavor ice so much with the Unmasked album there needed to be unmasked flavor ice so i made this box of flavor ice into unmasked flavor ice there you see the top the side and the back with that unmasked poster artwork fun stuff fun nerd stuff and you know when it's spring and you want to really enjoy the unmasked record go buy a box of flavor ice fruit pops and you'll see they go hand in hand with this record. And then in the same vein as the flavor ice, I also took it a step further and made Kiss Kool-Aid packets because we would also, listening to Unmasked, watching Inner Sanctum, we would often make Kool-Aid. We got really big on Kool-Aid one summer. We even collected the points and, <laughs> and ordered a pitcher off the back, back when you could still do that, back when they had a catalog and you could collect Kool-Aid points, you know, we're collecting Kool-Aid points and enjoying Unmasked. So that's a, I sounds nerdy, but it, it was fun and I don't regret a single moment of it. But we would often buy our Kool-Aid based on Kiss Colors. You know, Lemon Lime for Peter, Orange for Eric, Tropical Punch for Ace, Cherry for Gene, Grape for Paul. One day I decided I'm going to make Kiss Kool-Aid packets. And I have to say, they turned out pretty freaking awesome. Modge Podge, you know, some solo album faces on there. No more lemon lime Kool-Aid, so Peter had to be strawberry kiwi. 
but there's Peter. Tropical Punch for Ace. Cherry for Gene. Grape for Paul. I also made commercials for these that are on my YouTube channel. Just kind of search history. And I made a long time ago when I very first started making videos, I made Kool-Aid commercials. Okay, so why not go full on board and do the fawn of Kiss Kool-Aid, which also goes perfect with Unmasked. I say it's never been announced, but Kool-Aid is the official drink of Unmasked. Try it and you will believe. There you go. Now, Joy, let's not have any fooling around. Let's win that! So, anyone who is a part of the Kiss Wax Pack has received their Volume 1, Number 2, Spring Edition Unmasked issue. And the weekend that I was putting together the wax packs and folding them all up and stuffing the envelopes, my buddy Scotty reached out to me and said he had picked up an item from the solo album Army Kit that he needed, but he bought it as a, as a lot. And so he already had the solo album Army Kit. He needed the envelope that it came in, which is totally badass. I mean, that you talk about history, that's history right there. But he had an extra solo album army kit. And he mentioned we should give it away to a fellow Wax Pack member. And I thought that was extremely cool, extremely gracious. Scotty, thank you from the bottom of my heart and the bottom of whoever wins this heart. Every Wax Pack member is probably thankful for you for doing this because this is going to be super cool. So the lucky winner will receive this solo album Kiss Army Kit folder and this is the folder without the Boutwell address so if you get this and you don't have an army kit you're gonna have to add it on your list to find a army kit folder with the Boutwell address to be a completist and to be a complete nerd like we all are you will also receive now this isn't a full army kit but you will also receive these goodies inside of course the folder, the 8x10 of the band, the Gene Simmons 8x10, beautiful picture, the Ace Freely colored photo, the Paul Stanley 8x10, the Peter Chris 8x10, the solo album discography flyer and the solo album classified information booklet so there you are we are going to draw a winner of the solo album army kit if you're a wax pack member and you received your issue two wax pack you saw on the back page i did this together we wax and i listed everyone's names and where they're from who is a member of the kiss wax pack and in between me mailing out issue two and filming this video on march 17th we had one additional member join john b from maryland i am adding his name his name's not here because obviously this is issue two but i am adding his name to this list and we are going to do an old school price is right style draw a name I thought about doing a number generator, but this is the Wax Night Basement. This is 1980. You're hanging out at your friend's house, and we're talking Kiss. So we are doing an old school, Price is Right, three strikes drawing. Of course, FL Dog will not be on the list. He provided the army kit. Thank you again, FL Dog. But this is everyone in this drawing tonight. We shall see. One of you are going to go home. Well, go to your mailbox and receive a Kiss Army kit, courtesy of our buddy FL Dog, and a big thank you from me for joining the Wax Pack. So here we go. It is drawing time. I thought about, I thought about actually doing the drawing out of the flavor ice box, but that box is sealed and I didn't want to break it. I also thought about doing it out of one of the Jean 78 Magic Market cups. But I'm notorious for breaking merch when I play with it. And we're going to be shaking this cup up. So I didn't want to do it with that. So we're going not really old school, but we're going fun. 
because collecting these super big gulp 7-eleven cups was a lot of fun so we're gonna everyone's name is in a nice little folded thing and thing piece of paper and we're going to do this now let me raise that up a little bit drop these names one fell out drop these names into that and we will put them in the bag mix them up pull out a number and do our drawing Kenneth T from Denmark. So this is going all the way to Denmark. How cool is that? There you go. Kenneth T, you are the winner of the Kiss Army kit, solo album kit from FL Dog, and all of us here at the Wax Pack. Myself, Large Marge, Pee Wee. This was a lot of fun, and we might have to do this again. I'm thinking around maybe december -ish. that'll be the end of the year for the wax pack and possibly the end of the wax pack i don't know if it'll go on beyond this year but maybe do one more uh drawing put together something cool for uh one last christmas era wax pack giveaway thank you all for hanging with us tonight and waxing well thank you for being a member of the kiss wax pack if you already are and if you're not details below on how to join Large Marge says it's all about waxing nostalgia and celebrating the fun of being a KISS fan old school wise. This is old school fanzine stuff. Old school fun in an online world. Congratulations to Kenneth T. Thank you for hanging with us. Take care. Be safe. Be good to your babies. Oh, Large Marge says I'm just chilling out here in the Wax Night basement. Be good to your babies. Spay, neuter, microchip. Take care. Be safe. We will talk to you soon.